Hello! This tutorial is all about the different roles that can be assigned to a user in Nanja's LMS. We'll look at each role individually and identify what each role can do in the LMS. The first role is Administrator. An administrator has access to all of the features and settings of the LMS. This includes creating and modifying users and groups, creating and editing courses, creating and viewing discussion boards, accessing reporting data, and viewing and modifying all of the settings of the LMS. Administrators can also manage any sub-organizations that are created under their organization. Essentially, an administrator has full control of their organization in the LMS. The next role we will look at is Student. Notice how students are missing many categories in the sidebar compared to an administrator. Students are limited to four main actions. Accessing their course lists to complete their assigned courses, accessing discussion boards, accessing the reporting section to view their course scores, and editing their basic profile information. Most of the users in an organization will be students. The role of instructional designer has the same authorizations as a student with one important difference. Instructional designers can create their own courses and access and edit any course in the organization. The role of content creator is similar to the role of instructional designer. A content creator can also create courses, but only access and edit courses they have created themselves. They cannot edit someone else's course. Now that you have been introduced to the different roles in the Nanja LMS, you can assign the right role to your users. Thanks for watching.